Seven-time world champion Lewis Hamilton has won the inaugural Qatar Grand Prix in his Mercedes to cut Max Verstappen's overall lead in the Formula One championship battle to just eight points with two races remaining. Red Bull's Verstappen was second on Sunday, after starting seventh following a five-place grid drop for failing to respect warning flags in Saturday's qualifying but he earned a potentially crucial bonus point for fastest lap. Double world champion Fernando Alonso was third for Renault-owned Alpine, the 40-year-old Spaniard's first podium finish since 2014. Yet it was another frustrating afternoon for Australian Daniel Ricciardo, who missed out on the points again with his 12th place finish in his McLaren. It was pretty straightforward, it was pretty lonely at the front said Hamilton, who led from pole position and was never challenged over the 57 laps of the floodlit night race. Of course, I enjoy those races where you're battling through, but we needed those points today, so I think a real solid job from the team. Bring on the next two. The win was Hamilton's seventh from 20 races this season and the record-extending 102nd of his career also continued his record of being first to win at new circuits on the calendar. Verstappen, who has nine wins this year, carried out another solid piece of damage limitation as Red Bull cut Mercedes' lead in the constructors' standings from 11 to 5 points. Of course, our starting position was a bit compromised but luckily we had a really good start said Verstappen, who was fourth by the end of the opening lap and soon slotted into second. I know it's going to be difficult but that keeps it exciting. It's going to be a tight battle until the end. The 24-year-old Dutchman could still win the championship with a race to spare at the next round in Saudi Arabia if Hamilton fails to score. Red Bull had been mystified by the grid penalty for Verstappen, with team principal Christian Horner criticizing the punishment. However, he was given an official warning for suggesting a rogue marshal was to blame. The Briton apologised and also agreed to participate in an international stewards programme next February. Mexican Sergio Perez was fourth for Red Bull with Frenchman Esteban Ocon fifth for Alpine in a race with a sudden spate of punctures late on among those trying to make a single stop work. Lance Stroll took sixth for Aston Martin ahead of the Ferrari pairing of Carlos Sainz and Charles Leclerc. Lando Norris finished 9th for McLaren and Sebastian Vettel 10th for Aston Martin.